A neighbor of the suspect detained after an apparent assassination attempt on Donald Trump on Sunday expressed their surprise the man they'd seen as never mean-spirited and always welcoming was believed to be involved. Trump was the target of what the FBI said appears to be an attempted assassination at his golf club in West Palm Beach, Florida, just nine weeks after the Republican presidential nominee survived another attempt on his life. The former president said he was safe and well, and authorities held a man in custody. U.S. Secret Service agents stationed a few holes up from where Trump was playing noticed the muzzle of an AK-style rifle sticking through the shrubbery that lines the course, roughly 400 yards away. An agent fired and the gunman dropped the rifle and fled in an SUV, leaving the firearm behind along with two backpacks, a scope used for aiming and a GoPro camera, Palm Beach County Sheriff Rick Bradshaw said. The man was later stopped by law enforcement in a neighboring county. The suspect in custody was Ryan Routh, three law enforcement officials told the AP. The officials who identified the suspect spoke on the condition of anonymity because they were not authorized to discuss the ongoing investigation. Records show Routh, 58, lived in North Carolina for most of his life before moving to Hawaii in 2018. His neighbor in Kawa, Hawaii, Christopher Tam, said the news reports were very surprising. In 2020, Routh made a social media post backing Trump's re-election, but in more recent years his posts have expressed support for Biden and Harris. Routh tried to recruit Afghan soldiers fleeing the Taliban to fight in Ukraine, and spent several months in the country, according to an interview with the New York Times last year. The FBI was leading the investigation and working to determine any motive. Attorney General Merrick Garland was receiving regular updates. Agents with the Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco, Firearms and Explosives were helping investigate. Like I said, pr pretty kind. Uh, I, I travel a lot for work, and uh, my wife has been here, you know, on her own. And most of the neighbors around here have taken good care of her, and uh, and she's been one of them. Like never mean spirited and always welcoming, just in general. Every interaction we had with him was very, uh, uh, very welcoming and kind. I mean, it's just, we heard the news today and uh, it's just been very surprising and, uh, you know, obviously it sounds like it's a alleged occurrence, but, but, you know, the officials do their diligence in finding out what really happened, but if, if he did have anything to do with it, it's very, very shocking to us, certainly. Donald Trump was safe after gunshots were reported in his vicinity Sunday afternoon in Florida, according to Campaign and the Secret Service. It was not immediately clear whether the reported shots were targeted at the Republican presidential nominee. The U.S. Secret Service said it was investigating and that the incident occurred shortly before 2 p.m., the former president is safe, according to the Secret Service. No injuries were reported, according to a spokesperson for Palm Beach County Sheriff's Office. Roughly two months ago, Trump was shot during an assassination attempt at a rally in Pennsylvania, and a bullet grazed his ear.
Well, she's in her pink bikini. <laughs>